The Oklahoma Sooners are at odds of plus 2,500 to win the 2016 College Football National Championship, and they are at odds of plus 450 to take the Big 12 Conference Championship. Last season saw Oklahoma go 8-5 straight up, 5-8 against the spread, and 9-4 and on the over-under. Sooners head coach Bob Stoops has earned a 168-44 record in 16 years in Norman, Oklahoma. But this season, there will be a lot of new faces on the field, starting at quarterback. Trevor Knight was supposed to be the next heir to Landry Jones, but with inconsistencies in his game, he was benched late in the season. When Lincoln Riley came to the program to give the offense a facelift, finding a quarterback who can run the spread offense became his first job at hand. Baker Mayfield transferred from Texas Tech and apparently has secured the signal calling duties after sitting out last season. Mayfield became the first ever walk-on freshman to start a season opener in BCS history in 2013, and he took home the 2013 Big 12 Freshman Offensive Player of the Year honors that year. It was just announced that Mayfield will be the opening day starter against Akron, and after a year off due to transfer rules, the question is, can he reproduce a prolific freshman season that he had at Texas Tech two seasons ago? There is plenty of upperclassmen leading on the offensive line, although only center Ty Darlington returns in his starting role of the Big Five boys up front. Nila Casatati has 29 games under his belt at right guard with five career starts to his credit. Derek Farniak is set to take over at right tackle as the massive 6'8", 340 pounder has 27 appearances entering his senior season. Sophomore running back Samaji Perine ran for 1,713 yards in his freshman campaign while handling the ball 278 times in the run and pass game combined. Mike Stoop now enters his fourth season with his brother as the defensive coordinator in Norman. The front four in Stoop's 4-3 alignment is where the weakness can be found entering this season, especially after Jordan Phillips decided to forego his senior season and enter the NFL draft. Charles Walker gave the team a lift in the spring and is likely to take over for Phillips in the middle of the front line. The left end is set with Charles Tapper entering his senior season and the four-man rotation of Tapper, Matt Demon, DJ Ward, and Dwayne Orso will hopefully set up the season to create havoc in the opposing backfield. All three starting linebackers return and each of them appear in the top four of last year's leading tacklers. Senior Eric Stryker, might present the most difficulty for any offensive line after putting up a nine-sack season last year with 17 tackles for a loss. The schedule for Bob Stoops this season is not daunting until the final month of the season, when games include a home game with Iowa State, a road game at Baylor, a big home game with TCU, and the rival game at Oklahoma State to close out the season. Baker Mayfield may give some reason to have concerns about the offense, but a year in the system as a transfer will leave him with a good grasp of what the offense is trying to do this year. For our pick and prediction, we see TCU and Baylor likely to come out of the Big 12 battling for conference supremacy, but a bowl game bid is definitely going to come with some easy wins on deck to earn the postseason berth. There will be no conference title this season, but next year with Mayfield likely to start his second season in Norman, the view at the top might include the Oklahoma Sooners. For our Oklahoma Sooners betting predictions, check out the Bang the Book Betting Center. And don't forget that the Bang the Book Betting Center is your best resource for sports betting information before you make your weekly assault on the sports books.